The blessing of the Lord be upon you, my beloved brothers and sisters in Christ, my spiritual sons and daughters, covenant partners, people of the living God. Uh, it is once again that the Lord has allowed us to come together. I greet you with Jesus' joy, and I would urge you to join me as we spend time touching and agreeing in the name of Jesus. I don't want you to miss this time that we shall have together because we know that we need God to move. I know you need a move from the Lord. I know I need a move from the Lord. and We need a move from the Lord. So I would invite you to join me that we may go before God and encounter his presence and his power in the name of Jesus. I know you have a need from him and I believe he wants to meet that need. Will you join me tonight in the name of Jesus? I want to pray with you. I want to pray for you. I want us to touch and agree in the name of Jesus so that he will do just what we are expecting him to do in the name of Jesus. Oh, I'm calling on my intercessors. I'm calling on my prayer warriors, covenant partners. We want to touch heaven together in the name of Jesus. I don't want anyone to miss out tonight of what the Lord wants to do. I really feel tonight is going to be a night of breakthrough for the people of God. I, I really believe it. Glory to God. I'm so confident about that. I'm going to tell you to do something strange. I want you to get your wallet tonight. Get your wallet. I mean just that. Get your wallet and hold it in your hand as we're praying tonight. Because we're in a time where there are so many things going on and, and complications with finances. Hallelujah. I know that y'all are thinking to yourself, what is this man saying? What is he talking about? The Bible says that the Lord chooses the foolish things to confound the wise and the weak things to confound the mighty. I want you to get your pocketbook, get your wallet, get your credit card, your debit card, and whatever. Get your checkbook. Whatever, whatever we believe in God for, it takes finances. Hallelujah. We might have to travel. We might have to do some transactions. You might be in the middle of something. I want us to touch and agree in the name of Jesus. I've got mine right here. I'm not telling you to do something that I'm not going to do. I want everyone who chimes in, everyone who's listening in, who everyone who watches a replay to get their wallet. I want them to believe God for a supernatural breakthrough in every area, specifically their finances. For the Bible says that money answers all things. Everything that we need to do requires money. We need a move from God in our, I don't care what nobody say. We need a move of God in our money. We need God to remove the restrictions and the hindrances and those things that are trying to keep us broke, busted, and disgusted like we can't be trusted. I feel God wanting to release the supernatural to us tonight. Will you touch and agree with me in the name of Jesus? As we go before God, Haya, Hetebe Koshamandia. Would you touch and agree with me for just the next few moments? In the name of Jesus, I need you to believe God, even as you're writing down your prayer requests. Some of you are waiting for a better job. Some of you need a place to live. Some of you need a vehicle. Some of you, you got some bills that you don't know how they're going to get taken care of. Some of you got some other things that you need to do. And you're saying, Lord, I can't do it because I don't have the finance. I want to pray tonight, not just for you, but I want to pray especially for your finances tonight. Get your checkbook. Get your credit cards, your debit cards. Get your wallet. In the name of Jesus. I need you to believe God with me. I don't need you to, to spectate. I need you to believe God with me. I don't need you to analyze. I need you to believe God. I don't need you to rationalize. I need you to believe God. Hallelujah. If you're not going to believe God, then you don't want to be on with me tonight. I need people who are going to believe God because we need God to move in these finances. I don't know who I'm talking to. Glory to God. But this is what I believe tonight that the Lord is saying to me. Father, in the name of Jesus, 
We come to you tonight just to glorify you, to bless you. We come to praise you. We come to lift you up and magnify you. Oh, God, we come to let you know that we love you and we honor you. We appreciate you. We thank you because you've been better to us than we've been to ourselves. Lord, we want to glorify you because you gave us another day. You watched over us last night, woke us up this morning, and you have kept us until this very moment. Lord, there are those who have died. There are those, oh, God, who is in an accident. There are those, oh, God, who suffered tragedy on today but God you kept us and we want to tell you thank you Lord there is none like you in all the earth that's why we glorify you and we magnify you and we lift you up and we bless you because there's none before you there will be none after you none higher than you none below you none stand next to you because you alone are God none compared to you you alone are the only wise God you're the only one who is able to do exceeding abundantly above all we can ask or think according to the power that works in us. You are the author and finisher of our faith. It is you that we look to for you are the alpha, the omega, the beginning, the end, the, the first and the last. God, we look to you because you are the king of kings and lord of lords, creator of the universe and the sustainer of all life, the omnipotent, omnipresent, omniscient, omnicompetent God. It is you who are sovereign. Everything moves by your power. We pray that you would move right Right now, let your kingdom come, let your will be done in the name of Jesus. And even here, we ask you, God, that you would remove every witchcraft prayer, every sorcery prayer, every psychic prayer, every psychotic prayer, every satanic prayer that has been prayed against us to manipulate us spiritually and naturally in the name of Jesus. Those things that have come against us, oh God, to block the furtherance of our growth, the furtherance of our prosperity, the furtherance, oh God, of our blessings that you have bestowed upon us. We pray that every obstacle would be removed. Every limitation would be broken. Every yoke would be removed and it be destroyed by your anointing tonight in the name of Jesus. God, we come to you saying we need you even now as we spend this time communing with you. Then we need you, God, to give us clear passage and clear frequency that there is no interference from the prince of the power of the air that God as we call on your name you will hear us tonight God and you will respond without delay in the name of Jesus if there's anything that we have said or done or thought that has not brought glory and honor to your name we pray that you would forgive us now creating us a clean heart and renew a right spirit within us even now in the name of Jesus we pray that father that you would do a new thing in our life here we are calling on you Lord for some are sick some are afflicted, some are oppressed, some are depressed, some are suffering, some are being tried, God, some are struggling, but God, you have the answers because you are a way maker. You have the answer because you know how to remove the burden. You know how to take away the load. You know how to remove the shame. And God, we call on you because you are our God. And we're calling on you tonight, Lord, that you would show up and show yourself mighty and strong as we touch and agree to night with your people. We believe, God, that you're going to do something supernatural in the name of Jesus concerning our finances. Tonight, God, we hold our wallets. We hold our check well, books, God. We hold, oh God, our pocketbook. We hold our credit cards in the name of Jesus. Even the monies that are on us right now and we pray for a breakthrough in all of our financial transactions in the name of Jesus. We pray that Father, the spirit of favor would rest upon us right now even in our business transactions God in the name of Jesus we pray oh God for prosperity to be upon us in the name of Jesus we command all demonic hindrances to our finances to be totally paralyzed right now we break every circle of failure in our life in the name of Jesus we pray that the businesses we have would be shielded from evil observers right now we decree and declare that our blessings God are coming our way in the name of Jesus we pray right now that all business problems would receive divine solutions in the name of 
Jesus, God, we praise you right now. And we cancel the assignment of the enemy that would try to stop this or stop our prayers tonight in the name of Jesus. We pray that, Father, that we would be able to experience the things you have promised us, that your favor would be upon us in the name of Jesus. Everywhere we go, let your hand be upon us. Let your favor be upon us right now in the name of Jesus. We ask you to send ministering spirits of prosperity into our lives right now. Send finances into our lives right now in the name of Jesus. Let men and women bless us everywhere you go, we go. For Father, you told us that when we give, it shall be given to us. Good measure, pressed down, shaken together, and running over. You said men would give to our bosom. You promised that the wealth of the wicked was laid up for the just, and you said the just live by faith. Here we are, God. We're living by faith, for we believe your word. We're taking you at your word. God. So send them finances into our life. In the name of Jesus, we pray, oh God, that you would release us from the clutches of financial hunger. In the name of Jesus, we command the ministering angels to go and create favor, oh God, for us and for our business matters, for our ministries now. In the name of Jesus, we loose the spirit in all of the staff members who would even try to use evil weapons against us right now, including lying and gossiping and slander and being opinionated in the name of Jesus. We command financial hindrances to be removed in the name of Jesus. Father, we pray that you would even remove our name from those customers. Oh God, from the book of financial bankruptcy in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, be our senior partner in every business venture. Oh God, every good thing present presently in eluding our business should flow in into the mighty name of Jesus right now. We reject every financial spirit of embarrassment in the matchless name of Jesus. We cancel every assignment of embezzlement in the name of Jesus. Father, we pray that you would block every space causing unprofitable leakage to of our businesses and our ideas in the matchless name of Jesus. Father, we pray that our companies would become too hot to handle for the enemy in the name of Jesus. We pray for for spiritual magnetic power that attracts wealth and keeps wealth that it will be deposited into our accounts in the name of Jesus. Now, God, we pray that you would help us to submit to your will every day of our life, that we would make decisions based upon your word and based upon what you have shared with us in the name of Jesus. We pray that you would cause us to be spiritually and mentally alert even in our place of employment, where we go and how we deal with our finances right now. We pray that, Father, the plans and the purposes you've given us, oh God, for our business, the plans and purposes you've given us for our ministries, the plans and purposes you've given us for our household would bring honor and glory to your name right now, Father. We are praying, oh God, for financial breakthrough, for financial manifestation, oh God, for your spirit to rest upon us, that we become attractive to your favor. We become attractive to prosperity. We become attractive to wealth that wealth and riches will be in our house and our righteousness will be of you right now in the name of Jesus. I cancel every spirit of lack. I cancel anything that is circumventing our financial growth and prosperity right now in the name of Jesus. And as I touch and agree with your people tonight, we believe and we declare that our change is coming. Our breakthrough is coming and that we shall see the manifestation of finances immediately. We will wake up in the morning and find our accounts being increased in the name of Jesus. We will have checks in the mail in the name of Jesus. Some people will walk up to us and put it in our hands in the name of Jesus. We will walk into locations and find suitcases and bags filled with money right now, God. We go to Ziglag and we take back that which has been stolen. We receive the blessing of Obedidum upon our life that God, every step we take, will have to give 
your glory because God will have so much Lord that there won't be a struggle for us God that in the name of Jesus we won't have a problem paying taxes we will have enough to give it away in the name of Jesus we thank you that you will bless us so super abundantly that being a blessing to others won't be a burden oh God because we understand that the blessing you give us will not God be our God but you will be our God you will be our Lord and you will show us how to make good investments you will show us how to make good decisions with our finances God we believe it right now in the name of Jesus even the buildings we're looking at purchasing the deals we're looking at with contracts we thank you that is causing wealth to come into our life in the name of Jesus we'll be able to wave it before you and we'll be able to give you glory because of the, what you're manifesting in our life now God as we're touching and agreeing as we're believing you as our faith is confident in you we thank you God that we shall see it so we touch and agree tonight God with your son oh God Brandon love praying that you would touch him now in the name of Jesus. Whatever he's believing you for, do it right now. Thank you for Joy Jackson. Thank you for what you're doing in her life. I thank you that you're increasing her more and more. That God favor is upon her even now. Thank you God for Pastor Gary and Tink Malone. How you're moving on their behalf in the name of Jesus. There is no lack in their life. Oh God, for you're showing yourself mighty. Thank you for prophetic eyes, Lord. I pray that you would bless her now supernaturally, Lord. That there be nothing lacking in the name of Jesus. Oh God, we give you praise for Shakira Davis God, that you're moving on our behalf that Lord, you're making ways out of no ways. You're showing yourself mighty and strong in the name of Jesus. We bless you tonight God for Vivian Riley God, how you're moving on her behalf. Thank you for the supernatural release God, that which is waiting on. I thank you now that it's in route in the name of Jesus and that which is trying to take her out has been removed in the name of Jesus. Remember her children. I pray that you would keep them and strengthen them and have your way, God. Protect them and shelter them from every trick of the enemy in the name of Jesus. We pray for Eunice Cottingham in the name of Jesus. I pray that you would minister to her and strengthen her and show yourself mighty in the name of Jesus. God, you got a way of making ways out of no ways. We pray, oh God, for Karen Brooks, that God, you would touch her and heal her everywhere there's a hurt. I pray against uh, the spirit of infirmity. I pray against uh, the spirit of sickness. I pray against uh, the spirit of disease. Whatever's trying to hinder her from moving forward in her life. I thank you uh, that is being removed uh, right now in the in the name of Jesus. Oh God we bless you tonight for Quinita Griffin. Uh, yes Lord uh, we thank you uh, that you're moving on our behalf. You're showing yourself mighty and strong. God, when the enemy shall come in like a flood, lift up a standard against him. Oh God, for she loves you, God. Thank you, oh God, for Joanne Johnson. I pray, God, that you would stir her now in her spirit to move her into the places you're calling her to in this season. Oh God, you can do it, God. Move for crazy quarrels. Yes, Lord, as she's trusting you for a new thing. She's trusting you to show yourself mighty and strong in every matter of her life. I thank you that God, you're giving her victory. I thank you that you're stirring her up. Come on, oh God. You can do it, Lord. Thank you tonight, God, for Tarion Dykes, God. I pray, God, that you administer to her. Oh, Lord, show yourself mighty and strong in every area of her life. Oh, my God. Send breakthrough into her finances. Send breakthrough into her finances. Send breakthrough into her finances. In the we pray, oh God, for Paul Blunt. Thank you for your manservant. Thank you for his love for you. Thank you, God, for what he's seeking to do in the kingdom. I pray, God, that you would bring his vision to pass. I pray, God, that provision would be in place. Even now, God. I pray, God, that every 
every hindrance and every vision killer would be moved from his life in the name of Jesus. Every enemy, let them be removed forever, God. Mm, God, for you can do it, God. We thank you tonight for Connie Evans, Lord. Move on her behalf. Show yourself mighty. Show yourself strong. Bless her and keep her in the name of Jesus. We thank you tonight for Jewel Maria. Thank you, God, for favor in her life. Thank you for showing yourself strong. Yes, God, we say yes to your will. We say yes to your way. In the in the name of Jesus, we bless you tonight for Millage Callahan. In God, I pray that you administer to him. Give him supernatural strength. Extend his life. Extend his life. Extend his life. In the name of Jesus, I cancel the spirit of death. Even now, I cancel the spirit of strokes. I cancel the spirit of heart attacks. Even now, in the name of Jesus, I decree and declare that he shall live and not die to declare your works in the name of Jesus. Oh God, we bless you. Thank you tonight, God, for Nikel Mims. God, I pray that you would bless her and strengthen her, God. Show yourself mighty and strong in every area of her life. Oh God, you can move like none other. And we believe you tonight. Yes, God, we thank you tonight for Rashonda Brunson. Oh God, give us strength in this time. Give us strength in this season. Make a way, God, out of nowhere. Do what only you can do. Yes, Lord, we call on you tonight, God. We thank you, God, for Bishop Jefferson. Yes. Lord, minister to him, God, and take him higher. Thank you, God, that he's walking in his wealthy place even now in the name of Jesus. We pray for his father-in-law that God, if it be your will, extend his life right now in the name of Jesus. Send your power, send your anointing right now, God, and stir him and resuscitate him, revive him, rejuvenate him, restore him the joy of his salvation. Yes, God, that he may tell men and women that you're still on the throne and you're still doing great things in the name of Jesus. We thank you tonight, God, for Kenyella Garland. I pray that, God, you would strengthen her tonight and minister to her. I pray for supernatural breakthrough in the name of Jesus. I come against every spirit that is trying, oh God, to remove her from the place you're calling her to in the name of Jesus. Have your way, God. You got power. We believe it, God. Thank you tonight, God. For Angela Blake. Oh, God. I pray a special blessing on her. I pray that you would move for her so strongly that her mother and father would encounter your power in the name of Jesus. That they would bless your name. Oh, my God. Cause her to be the reason that the family is blessed in the name of Jesus. So come on, God. Perform your promise in the name of Jesus. We pray, oh God, for Alicia Lewis, that you would minister to her tonight. Give her strength in the name of Jesus. When she feels like giving up, give her strength and whisper to her and let her know that she can make it, God, in the name of Jesus. Oh God, we cry out to you, for you have the power and you can. We believe you right now. Oh, God, we thank you for Layla Cherry, God. I pray now that you'd reach down in Savannah and give her some strength God. Help her to make it through the things she's facing. Yes God, bless her and her children. Keep them safe God from all harm, from all danger. God, you got power. Mm, God, you got power. Release that what is needed for her to make it till the next day and then the day after until it reaches her. Oh God, through the rest of her life in the name of Jesus. Come Oh, God, we're trusting you, Lord. We bless you tonight for Marguerite Hastings, God. Thanking you, Lord, for her life. Thanking you, God, for the things you're doing in her. Thank you for how you're proving yourself to her. Marguerite, the Lord said in this season, he's opening your eyes. He's going to cause you to see who is really for you and who's really not. God said, don't be surprised when you see what's been going wrong. He said, because you've been sensing it, but you couldn't prove it. But God said, I'm about to 
to give you the proof. I'm about to give you the proof that you've been waiting for. God said he's opening your eyes. God said he's opening your eyes. And he said he's going to remove the tears in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, I thank you for doing it right now, God. We pray tonight for Lois Booker, God. You know everything about her. You know what she's in need of. I pray that you would move in the super name of Jesus. I pray that you'd show yourself mighty, show yourself strong, because you are God. There is nothing too hard for you. We pray, oh God, for Prophet Raz tonight and Bishop Hutchins, God. I pray that you'd move on their behalf. Lord, as they do the kingdom work, they need more. They trust in you for more. I pray you do it, Lord, in the name of Jesus. We pray, oh God, for Sierra Bright. Do it right now, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Show yourself mighty in every situation. Come on, oh God. You can do it, God. I pray for Sandra Rios. Sandra Rios, I pray, God, that you'd make ways out of no ways. Sandra Rios, I hear the Lord saying to tell you promotion is coming. Promotion is coming. Get ready to travel for promotion is coming. Get your bags packed. Promotion is coming. You're about to be a representative that is going to travel. I hear God. He said promotion is coming. You're getting ready to travel. Thank you right now. I believe you, Lord. I know you will. And thank you, God. We pray, oh God, for Fabian Naomi. Oh, my man, I pray, God, that you would bless her tonight and strengthen her, God. I pray you would move in a supernatural way. Whatever she's in need of, God, show yourself mighty. Show yourself strong. Fabian Naomi, the Lord told me to tell you that the curse is broken. He has broken the curse curse of lack. The curse is broken. That which has tried to keep you hindered, it is broken. In the name of Jesus. Now you're going to be able to move forward and things shall flow. God said he's working on your behalf in the name of Jesus. God, we thank you for Roderick Spurgeon, the Lord, and what you're doing in here. How you have moved on his behalf. How you have destroyed the coil of of the snake that was trying to squeeze the life out of him. Thank you that he can breathe again. Thank you he can exhale. Thank you that he can move forward without any hindrance in the name of Jesus. Oh, oh God, we pray for businesses tonight that, Lord, you would cause them to come up and prosper in the name of Jesus. As you told me on yesterday, let this be favorable miracle manifestations in this time and in this season. Oh, God, let your miracles outweigh all of the pandemic that we've seen. Let it outweigh all the deaths we've seen. And God, we even believe you for punitive damages. What we had to go through psychologically and mentally. Oh, God, we thank you that you're restoring us. Even now, in the name of Jesus, we pray, God, oh, Lord, for your woman servant, Mildred Johnson. Thank you, God, for meeting her needs. Thank you, God, for providing for her. Thank you, God, for showing yourself strong in her life. Oh, we praise you, God, for your grace is sufficient and your strength is made perfect in her weakness, Lord. Thank you tonight, God, for Pastor Valinda Wilkerson. Thank you, God, for having your way in her life. Thank you, oh, God, for blessing her ministry. Thank you, God, for blessing the works of her hands. Yes, Lord. Pastor Belinda, the Lord said, the oil is flowing in your hands. The Lord said, the oil is flowing in your hands. Be careful what you put your hands on. You cannot sanction everything. The oil is flowing in your hands. Don't endorse everything, the Lord says. Don't endorse. I don't know what you got going, but God told me to tell you, don't endorse everything. Be very careful where you put your hands on. 
God says, I don't want your hands in everything. I don't want your hands on everything. Be very careful because there's an oil flowing in your hands. God, we praise you for what you're doing now. Oh, we give you glory in the name of Jesus. We thank you tonight for Michelle Ellis and thank you, God, that you're moving on her behalf. That God, you're showing yourself mighty and strong in the name of Jesus. Thank you for Estella King, God. Raise her up higher in you, Lord. Take her into new places in the spirit. In the Come on, God. We believe you that you can do it, Lord. We trust you tonight. Show up, oh God. Show up. We pray, God, for Tom Ackerman. Yes, Lord. I pray that you would shield him and shelter him from every attack of the enemy, from every wicked one that would come against him. Because when you're for him, God, you are more than they that be against him. Shelter him in the name of Jesus. We pull out every dagger out of his back in the name of Jesus. We cancel the assignment of the backstabber and the betrayer right now, God. Yes, God, we bless you in the name of Jesus because we know you're moving. We know you're showing yourself mighty and strong. Yes, we say yes. In times like this, God, we say yes to you, Lord. In times like this, Lord, we trust in you. In times like this, God, we believe in you, God. We call on you, for we have no other help. We call on you because we need you. We call on you because we're waiting for the manifestation of what you promised in the name of Jesus. We pray tonight, God, for Barbie calling. in the Yes, God, I pray that, God, you would keep Keep her in times like these. Keep her, oh God, from temptation. Keep her from, de oh God, from deception. Keep her, God, from seduction. Keep her, oh God, from lies. Keep her from pits. Oh God, I pray that you would keep her from being ensnared by the enemy. But God, shelter her and cover her with your blood. Oh God, only you can do it, God. That's why we call on you. You're the only one we can depend on. You're the only one, oh God. God, we remember tonight Apostle Smith in New Haven, Connecticut. We pray that you would touch him uh, from the crown of his head to the sole of his feet. We cancel the assignment of the enemy right now in the name of Jesus. I pray that God, you would raise him up for your glory. Yes, Lord, we believe it and we receive it now in the name of Jesus. We pray, God, for Shelly Atherley. Oh, God, I pray, God, that you would bless her indeed enlarge her territory. Let your hand be upon her. In the name of Jesus, we believe it and we receive it. In the world like this, we know that you're still able to do great things. Look at Naomi Washington tonight. Naomi, I don't know what this means, but the Lord said, I'm erasing the history. That which is trying to hinder you from going into greater things. God said, I'm erasing the history. Whatever's been negative connected to your name, God said, I'm erasing it. Whatever the negative report was with your name, God said, I'm erasing it. God said, I'm erasing it. God said, I'm erasing it. God said, I'm doing a new thing. Watch me, says the Lord. Watch me. Don't take your eyes off of God. And we thank you, Lord, for what you're doing. I need somebody who will lift up the name of the Lord even now. Oh my God. Yes, Lord. Somebody needs a healing, God. Somebody needs a miracle. Right now, God, you're a miracle worker. You're a healer, God. I cancel the assignment of sickness now. I cancel the assignment of infirmity. I cancel the assignment of disease against your people. That go, God, which has come to hurt your people, I thank you now that it will help your people. That which was made to stall them. I thank you now that it will shoot them into a greater place in the name of Jesus. Oh, we give you glory, God, because you're moving. Send a fresh anointing upon our life. 
in times like these that God you would move because we need you right now God we need you Jesus we can't make it without you in times like these we are desperate for you we are lost without you we can't make it without you that's why God we cry out to you you told us to call on you and you would answer us and show us great and mighty things that we don't know tonight God I thank you for my longtime friend Janet Barnes I pray that Lord you would touch her now and strengthen her God I pray that you would meet every need that whatever is lacking in her life you would meet the need now I pray for her children God that you would keep them covered under your blood for you have the power to do it in the name of Jesus oh God we believe you oh God we trust you oh God we're calling on you in the day yes Lord have your way right now oh God thank you God for Penny Grant in the name of Jesus I pray that father you would move on her behalf strengthen her God show yourself mighty and strong in every situation of her life thank you oh God for prophet Robin flowers Lord thank you for moving on her behalf thank you for showing yourself mighty in every area thank you for supernatural strength thank you for open doors thank you God that there's no uncertainty or confusion in her life but that God you're making everything clear that she can go forward in this season oh God we praise you Lord and we give you glory right now Lord we pray oh God that you would remember Sierra bright God I pray that you would bless her God in the name of Jesus oh Lord those who are coming on those I can call those I can't call you know them all have your way right now for Edna Richardson Lord show yourself mighty because you got the power Lord your people are waiting for their prosperity they're waiting for their success we believe it God that this is the season that it shall come we pray tonight for Mary Ted that you would dry the eye and you would move on her behalf in the name of Jesus let her not be stressed let her not be frustrated but show your power in the Nandabohoshanda in the Oh God, we still believe you that you're going to do it. We believe you for manifestation. We believe you're going to. Thank you, God, for Dominique Johnson. God, I pray now that you would move on his behalf. Yes, Lord, as he's believing you for great things for his family, I thank you that it's being manifested in times like these and that nothing that the enemy shall do will hinder him or hurt him for God you've given him power to conquer you've given him power to accomplish you've given him power to advance and we thank you in the name of Jesus oh we bless you God hallelujah we give you glory God we thank you God for your healing power those you are healing right now you're removing headaches you're removing backaches you're removing high blood pressure. You're removing low blood pressure. You're healing of sugar diabetes. Oh God, even the cancer is drying out now in the name of Jesus. For your power is able to do it. You said you were wounded for our transgressions. You said you were bruised for our iniquities and the chastisement of our peace was upon you. But with your stripes, God, we decree we are healed. With your stripes, God, we decree declare we are healed. With your stripes, we demand we are healed in the name of Jesus. And we thank you that the enemy is defeated. We command the enemy to lose his hold on everything that belongs to the things you've given us. And we command him to take flight. Now in the name of Jesus, we bind ourselves to your promise. We bind ourselves to your plan. We bind ourselves to your purpose in the name of Jesus. We bind ourselves to your prosperity for our life. We bind ourselves to the mind of Christ now. Yes, God, in the name of Jesus, we thank you and we're giving you glory, God. Help us to be a help to your kingdom in the name of Jesus. Help us, oh God, to show your love to one another. Help us to come closer together. Oh, 
all God and not be a denomination just but be your holy nation and your peculiar people your chosen generation your peculiar people oh God we pray that you would move now God in the name of Jesus we pray for Nificent Glow that you would minister to her thank you for her new grandbaby now baby now Lord we pray that you would cause that baby to be covered fried by your blood that none of the harms of this world would get the best of that baby we pray tonight for your son Clarence Power thanking you God for what you've been doing in his life I pray that God you would raise him up in the city that don't think he's good enough raise him up to do great things raise him up to dominate raise him up oh God to take over the land that you have promised him I thank you that you're manifesting great things right now in the name of Jesus oh God we pray God for Nakatunda Marmo oh Lord you know who this is move on your servant and have your way oh God right now we pray for unique Lewis right now God show your strength show your might show your power yes God we tell you yes we thank you in advance we praise you now is there anybody who will praise him God we surrender to you we surrender to your will we surrender to your way we thank you tonight for Terrence Simpson God thank you for ministering thank you for showing up God and showing yourself strong in the matchless name of Jesus thank you for having your way for those who will come on even after this point we pray that God you would move on their behalf break every shackle destroy every yoke remove every burden in the name of Jesus we're believing you now that finances are showing up in the name of Jesus we believe you that prosperity is showing up God and you're going to give us direction even now God you're going to show us God how to move forward where we won't have to worry about overheads but God we will be the lender and not the borrower we will be the head and not the tail we'll be above only and not beneath we'll be blessed when we go out and blessed when we come in everything we put our hands to will be blessed in the name of Jesus we command you God to bless us in our craft bless us in the craft of writing bless us in the craft of singing bless us in the craft of crafts bless us in the craft oh God of makings yes Lord whatever it is that you've gifted us to do bless us in that area in the area of catering bless us now in the name of Jesus, we pray that all restrictions, all hindrances will be removed. We decree and declare that, Lord, you are that spirit. And where the spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. So we decree and declare that there's liberty in our life. There's liberty in our finances. There's liberty in our family. There's liberty in our health. In the God, we give you glory. God, we give you praise. God, we magnify you and we bless you. God, we thank you that even our setbacks, oh God, have not hindered us in the name of Jesus. But it's only been the setup for the major comeback. And we thank you that this is the time of the comeback in the name of Jesus. God, we glorify you. Oh, my Hosea, shake us, oh God, until you your glory shows up. Shake us, oh God, until the wealth shows up. Shake us, oh God, until the blessing is manifested. Shake us, oh God, until you're able to see what you're looking for in us. We thank you. We pray, God, for Malik Hopkins. We pray, God, for Andrea Blackman. Oh God, even those who are looking in now, they're tuning in now, they're replaying now. I pray that your hand be upon them, that you would bless them soon. Supernaturally, oh God, that that which is draining them will now strengthen them in the name of Jesus. God, we praise you. We give you glory. We say yes to your will. We say yes to your way. We say do what you want to do. Get your glory, God, in the name. 
Oh God, we're believing you, God, for those in the hospital, those in rehabilitation centers, those who are, oh God, in hospice, those who are in prison. God, we pray for them now that you would show yourself mighty and strong in their life. God, whatever needs to be done, that your glory can be manifested. We give you permission to do it, Lord, in the name of Jesus. We cancel everything that's working against your people right now, and we say your will be done. In the not what we want, God, but your will. For you said you know how to deliver the godly. You said you know how to work it out when we cry to you. You promised that you would show us great and mighty things that we don't know. So, God, we're taking you at your word. We remind you of your word in the name of Jesus. We thank you for performing it even now in the name of Jesus. We thank you for the now season, the manifestation of what you're doing right now. We thank you that, God, our hope is not making us ashamed. We thank you for great faith and confidence in you. And we are trusting you with everything, God. We give you everything. We say, have your way, Lord. Be gracious and merciful and bless us now. Holy are you, God. Holy are you, God. Holy are you, God. Holy are you. We bless you right now, Lord. Now have your way, God, in the name of Jesus. As we're preparing for this election, let your will be done, God. Only what you have designed, only what you have ordained, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Let it not be about the Republicans. Let it not be about the Democrats, but let it be about you, oh God. Your kingdom come. Your will be done. We put the government upon your shoulders, Lord, that you can handle it in the name of Jesus. And we thank you that you're doing it now. We thank you for moving by your power. We thank you, God, for those families that lost loved ones. We pray for their comfort. We pray that you would strengthen them now in the name of Jesus. We thank you, God, that you're anointing us to do even greater things in times like this. We thank you, God, that you have assigned your ministering angels to go forward and minister on our behalf. Oh, God, we glorify you for wisdom. We glorify you for the ability and the power to get wealth. We thank you for your wisdom. We thank you for your understanding. We thank you for your spirit resting upon us. Now, God, we say do as you have promised. We thank you now, and we are careful to give your name the honor, glory, dominion, majesty, honor, and praise is thine in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Oh, we bless you. Huh? Hallelujah. I just need somebody to say, Lord, do it. Huh? Glory. Come on. That's all I want you to do for the rest of the week is say, Lord, do it. I just need somebody to say, Lord, do it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Lord, do it. 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 That's all I'm saying tonight. Lord, do it. Lord, do it. Lord, do it. Yes, God. Because you can. Lord, do it. 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 As we lift up our finances to you, we lift up our wallets, our checkbooks, our credit cards. We say, Lord, do it. 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 Do it for us, God. 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 God. Do it, oh God. Do it, oh God. Do it, oh God. Do it, oh God. In the name of Jesus, we praise you. Oh God. God, we bless you tonight. We na 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 man so konde de de bel shabaya. Who can na 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 man dia? Da 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 na man si kan na da 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 bo shaya. Ia la 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 bo siya. Yes, God, we thank you tonight. We thank you. Ooh, my God. Okay, okay, who can announce ya? But the God, the God we serve, the God we serve, He's doing great things. The God we serve is doing great things. In this season, He will not allow you to be deceived. 
Listen to me. In this season, the Lord will not allow you to be deceived. He's doing great things right now. He's doing great things. There's a reason things are happening around you because anytime God is going to do something big, he has to shake things up. You don't hear me. Anytime God is going to do something big, he has to shake things. Okay, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Anytime God is going to do something big, he shakes things up. And that's what's happening around you. Things are shaking around you because God is doing something big. You don't believe me? Ask Paul and Silas while they were in the inner prison. They begin to pray at midnight. And the Bible says that at midnight there was a great shaking because there was an earthquake. When God is getting ready to do something big, there's a shaking going, okay, I'm gone. I'm gone. The Lord bless you. The Lord keep you is my prayer. If you haven't shared this prayer with anybody, if you haven't tagged anybody in this prayer, now is the time to do it. God is up to something for you, and he's up to something for them. In Jesus' name, I love you all. Will you join me tomorrow night, 8 o'clock? Join me tomorrow night, 8 o'clock, Eastern Standard Time, 7 Central. I want to share something with you. In Jesus' name, the Lord bless you and keep you is my prayer. Until tomorrow, 8 p.m. Eastern, we say... Shalom, shalom.